What's up everybody? We are here with Scuba Steve in Central Ohio, just outside of Cincinnati. Today we're hunting for fossils and all sorts of awesome relics here in the river. Already we got a nice kill layer. With that being said guys, let's go find some fossils. I came from the mud. Oh, I do. Oh. oh. Strong like a tree. There's roots where I stand. Crying in progress. Oh, I've been running from the law. First throw, baby. Say it, everyone. This is a first for me. This is a first Let's go find some fossils. No, 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 that, that, no, that's a little different. I like it though. What's up, Mini Steve? <laughs> All right, watch out for those rocks there. You ready? Mm -hmm. All right. Like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> Woo! Uh. Find things, baby. Yeah, you definitely jump in. You probably got like a, what? Two feet extra, eight feet deep. It's probably. I didn't like even touch the ground. So it's probably eight, eight feet deep, nine feet deep. I think it's about ten feet. Great killer! Wow, guys, there's some amazing here today. Let me show them real quick. We just found these in the hillside. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go grab some sifters and uh, some shovels, and we're gonna just kind of work into this bank side. And Bean's just gonna slap me for motivation. Yeah. Look at this, guys! Wow, it's, and it's a beautiful horn coral. I cannot wait to get my goggles on and snorkel around here. We got our piece, just the tip of the horn coral, but this one's beautiful. It completely avoid of all that excess rock and uh, different material on there. That being said, guys, I'm gonna start basically digging into this side and working through the material, getting our class wires and our shovels, and uh, that being said, we're gonna get the shovel and get digging. Got us a holy rock. This looks like it could have been used as a bug almost. It's pretty cool. Putting all of our treasures that we find so far in here. And uh, that'd be sure, guys. And then, you see how it, it basically what it does is it grades it, right? It gets okay. rid of all that fine fill. Okay. And now we can kind of look through. See one? All right, here's like a cool little, some, just some granule striation to the rock. But. Oh, look at this one. Yeah, see, boom. Okay. What is this? That's a cool rock. Nice. I like that. What's up? Oh, that looks like a piece of granite. Where is that? Alright guys, we we're digging out. We just caught it. It's a really, really tiny little piece of coral. Oh, this is a really cool fossil here. I don't know if you guys can see that. We'll try to take some really cool pictures of this one later on, guys. This is a really nice one. Nice job. Good to see you guys check him out. He's going to be coming out here. Steve? Careful you don't lose all of our freaking work! Go slide it right through the dig zone! <laughs> um, there was a shell there. Alright. See, I tried to like... Where we went. Wow. What is it? Look what you just found. Great, great eye, uh, great find. This is a beautiful and already kind of polished agate. Beautiful straight. This is an agate, the type of like crystalline rock. That? I think I just found a little button, guys. A little stone button here. Yeah, oh, right look here. at this, guys. Look at I'm this one. Ooh, nice tip of a horn coral. Heck yeah, man. That's a good one. Small ones, partial ones, but at the end, Danny had a good point. We're going to go through, guys. Pick out all of our favorite rocks and collages. Wow. What'd she find? Oh, here, toss that over here. That's all. Oh, nice, hon. That's a partial decayed horn coral. 
Well, we just found ourselves, guys, some really, really nice piece of what looks like either flint or maybe this is an agate. Adventuring today found this awesome piece of coral. Nail shell. Oh, dude, nice one. These are great. And you found these just spotting along the beach? Just walking around. That's often where you find the best ones. I know. Before we go, I'm going to take a nice long walk all the way down that. What you got, Danny? Let me know if you see it. Oh, dude. Yeah. And some beach glass. <laughs> Dude, nice. Oh, that that's a cool half. one. It's a split in half. It's like a nice piece for just for show. Yeah. Like just to see the innards. Dude, you nice. Look? What do you got here, buddy? I got this dog and look what's right there. Oh, nice, dude. Another piece of coral. Or a horn coral. Nice, dude. Yeah, guys. That's the method that we're doing here, Dave. And that's the best way to go about this. Dig a hole, attack one spot, and you sit there for hours. Sift it through, and you'll find incredible finds. Heck yeah, nice job, buddy. Scoop of Steve behind me, keep me nice and dry. That squirt gun axe, or nice and cool, sorry. We're going through a lot of material here, guys, working through some rocks, every now and then finding some cool ones. Mm, nothing wild in this time, just a little piece of uh, something, something, but another one. Oh, that's old, uh, like, tile or brick or something from one of the old manufacturing or structural houses. Because like you can see, we're going to find all sorts of things from all different eras and it's going to be all mixed and jumbled up together. The reason is, you did find a fossil. The reason all these different things from millions of years ago to hundreds of years ago to yesterday is as you can see, this area works like a turnpike for almost a blender for material. As the water comes in, it gets blend all up, pushed up into this bank here, under there, into these different deposit zones where we dig it out and find fossils. All right, guys, we got a couple things right here. Right off the bat, we got a nice piece of horn coral right up, sitting on top. And we got this perfect tiny little fossil shell here, guys. That is so cool. This is millions of years old. History in our hands. Look at that. Look at There's a couple things in here. Look at these. Look at that. That's a cool fossil right there. And these two are crystals and fossils right there. Keep those in your butt, little pan. <laughs> This is in the water. This was in the water. Oh, look at this one. It's a nice one. That's a really nice fossil. Good find. Nice job. Keep that. Just found a nice agate. Look at that one. Beautiful striation. It's still not quite as good as crystals. What'd you just find, dude? Nice. I just, I just touched this. Just grabbed hey, it welcome, dude. That's your first like... horn coil find, man. Congratulations. Yeah. See you walking away with some serious treasure. 300 million plus years in your hand, baby. That's an awesome find. And while he's finding that, we just pulled out this awesome piece with just a ton of really cool kill layer in it. This is a really, really neat one. I might try this. It's a big one, but I might try to set this aside, bring it back to the garden. Look at this one, guys. This is a nice oh, one, too. Wow. Look at how oh, pearly. That just came out of my hand, dude. I was just moving rocks. That's nuts, guys. You never know how you're going to find them, man. That's why you just got to get out here and find things, baby. Oh, nice one. What'd you just find here, little Steve? Nice one. That's a really nice fossil. Good find. We having a good time out here? What do we do here at Badger Exploration? Exploration. And we find things. Woo! What's up, guys? Today, we found a bunch of really cool fossils. Having a great time. Looks like Badger and Haley from Scuba Steve's team. They are going to jump. I'm not saying it's not deep. It's just What's comfortably up, not deep enough for me to jump up. All right, watch out for those rocks there. You ready? Come on. All right. Hold up. Like, comment, subscribe. This <laughs> hat. Not the hat. There goes Haley. <laughs> That wasn't even a jump. Woo! Woo! <laughs>